hello and namaste this is Susanna and I'm again back with another story for today so today's story is about Manu Ra Maha so here Manu is the name of this beer and Maha means honey so the story is about Manu and honey did you remember what did I tell his name this is not just a beer, but he has his name, and that's Manu. So once uh, upon a time, there was a bear whose name was Manu, and he was he used to love honey. One day, he was very hungry, so he went inside his room and started searching for his favorite honey. He just looked around and everywhere around the room but he could not find it but after some time he found that a bottle of honey was just above his head so he tried to reach out to get the honey but when he opened the cap of the honey bottle he could see that there was no honey oh poor manu it was so much tempting to eat that honey but the bottle was completely empty so he thought hmm, oh I forgot to buy some honey when I went outside yesterday okay anyways I'll go to the shop to the market and I'll buy my favorite honey saying this Manu went outside his house to the market on the way he could see the greenery because he used to live in village he, he could see some green hills and greenery everywhere so manu kept on walking walking sometime um, he went up the hill and sometime he uh, went down the hill because the way was so much tumbling around so up and down up and down just and after some time there was a road which was again up and down up and down cross and cross but he kept on walking because he was in so much of hunger and he wanted to have his honey but so he kept on walking 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 and after some time there came a river and in that river there was a small bridge you can see in this picture isn't it the water is flowing but there's a small breeze to cross the road and you can see the fish, fishes are also swimming in the water but this manu he doesn't want to take and doesn't want to care about this fish because he has only honey in his mind then he across the river across the river and started walking 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 and again walking now you can see the road is a little bit narrow but it's straight it was a long way to the market but he kept on walking so and after some time he was about to reach market like you can see the road is pitched now it's not like up and down or greenery everywhere but you can see a lot of houses are here so that's because he has entered the market so he thought of now crossing the road mm, Manu was so clever he know all the traffic rules so he knows that red means stop green means get ready and yellow means stop green means go so he waited for the traffic signal and when it was ready he just crossed the road and just across the road there was a shop his favorite uncle's shop and by reaching there he said uncle hey uncle can you give me a bottle of honey i love honey so much today i wanted to eat some but it was finished so i came a long way to your shop just to buy honey could you give me a bottle of honey here's your here's the money uncle and the uncle said yes yes manu we have honey okay so you are hungry oh 
Okay, I'll give it to you right away. Which bottle do you want? Small, big or large? And he just said, I just want a small bottle because I am also small. He said that, you know, uncle, honey is my favorite. I saw fish on my way, but I didn't feel like catching it because I wanted to have this honey. Manu said, and uncle also said, Yes, Manu, I know. You always feel so tempting looking at the honey. Yeah, you have. The uncle gave honey to the to Manu and he said, You can sit here and have your honey if you're very hungry so that you can walk long way back to your home. But you won't be hungry anymore. So it will also give you energy. You know, honey is not just a sweet but it has a lot of advantages that a body can take from take it from isn't it like honey is like you don't have it's better than sugar honey also warms your body makes your skin glow isn't it so yes yes uncle i know mona said okay let me have my honeys saying that manu started having his honey and after some time he felt so full and he burped oh, oh, doing this <laughs> and he was so full he's, he's showing his tummy that oh, okay i'm okay now so i can go back to my home someone will thought okay now i need to return then he went to his way back home but suddenly he remembered the oh i forgot to thank uncle i must go i should say thank you for giving me such a mm, good honey then he thought of going a little bit back and he said thank you uncle i loved your honey i'll come next time to buy more honey thank you for today and having me sit here and have it i feel so energized now it's time for me to go home otherwise my mother will scold me for doing so much of delay saying that uncle also said okay manu please take care and come back again so having said that manu went home do you like honey or not? See, you don't always have to have honey directly from the bottle. You can mix it with hot water or you can apply it in your bread, chapati, and in everything where you want to add sweet instead of sugar. Is the name. So don't forget to get a bottle of honey and get it benefit from its advantage advantages. Thank you for today. And that was the end of the story. I hope you liked the story of Manu and Honey. I'll be back again with yet another story next time. Until then, stay safe and take care.